Hey guys, it's Yvette and I have my Project Sweetwater to open right now and it comes in a plain brown box so there's nobody knows what's in it and um oh but you do get this which is a hint to you <laughs> and I'm ready to open it. Let's get going. And I know that probably other people have already um, gotten theirs and opened it. I know because uh, Becca was telling Steph and I what was in it. And it was like, uh, <laughs> I want to be surprised. Um, I know you guys are hearing lots of notifications over there. And it's because I forgot to move my iPad. And so now you guys are hearing all the notifications. I truly apologize. It just seems like right now my book club is like blowing up and I don't know why. Sorry. Um, okay, so we open it up and it's just like this. And okay, so we have our paperwork. Uh, oh, okay, so coming in March is spring chicken. Can't wait for that. Um, I ordered a bit of spring chicken, so uh, check out my Etsy shop once we once it starts coming in because it is absolutely adorable and um here's like what here's a little peek of what it looks like look at them little chickens little chicks <laughs> and i love this flower one. Oh my goodness i'm gonna have to do a post for y'all so y'all can see um Okay, so this is the line that is in this box is called Animal Crackers. I have a little bit of that in my Etsy shop if you want to go check it out. Um, but this is it, it and it's super adorable too. And I'm going to show you. Uh, it looks like we got a very small um, fat quarter bundle. And I will, I have a fat quarter bundle. So I will pull one out and show it to you so you can like uh, see all the fabrics in it. And okay, so, oh my goodness, we got a little package of animal crackers <laughs> inside. And I'm very happy to say that mine are not broken, are popped open. I think, I think uh, Becca said hers, well, I don't think, I know, I saw hers was like all popped open and um, all over her box. Personally, I would eat them anyway. up <laughs> y'all it has been a minute since i have had you want one it has been a minute since i've had an animal cracker these are yummy oh my god okay i'm not gonna sit here and just eat an entire package of animal crackers on the, a video for y'all all right so here is the little pack of um, fat quarters that we have received. And um, just to give you an idea, not, I'm not saying anything about it. I'm just saying here's what they've given us. And this is the actual fat quarter bundle. Um, super adorable and I love all of them so I will open this in just a sec and show all of them to you just so that you can see but this is what we have received in the project Sweetwater we receive enough to do the projects that they've included inside which I love that they include the projects inside it's super balls. so um, we also got a charm pack and instead of going like going through all of these fabrics, I'm going to show you all of the fabrics in the fat quarter bundle. And that will more than suffice to show you everything that's in here. Okay, then we have some labels. And if you're not already enrolled in tagged, you might want to think about it. They've got the most awesome um, iron on labels. I love them. And it looks like the ones that I got, I don't know if everyone gets the same or different, I don't know, but I got Pig, Kitty, and Teddy. And I think they have nine or 12 different kinds. I don't remember exactly. But those are like so super cute. Okay, 
then they gave us a little piece of something and there's always a reason. <laughs> so we got this little piece of cream fabric. Okay. And all right, so now we're coming to all the projects. I'm gonna scooch this down for a minute or scooch it over. Okay. Um, okay, so first they've given us a pattern called Little Dreamer. I like this one. Uh, this pattern will make a quilt that is 45 by 45. And you will need um, one honey bun of their fabric. You'll need one and a half yards of background cream fabric. You'll need four border prints at an eighth of a yard each. Uh, you should get a green, blue, red, and orange. And that's these long pieces here. And that's if you're gonna make it exactly like theirs, right? Um, you'll need half a yard for binding, three yards for your backing, and your batting piece should be approximately 52 inches by 52 inches square. That is really pretty. I like it. I really do. And I love this fabric, especially like guys, like once you see it in person, it's so much different than like seeing it. And sometimes it's not, sometimes, you know, you'll, you'll look at a collection in, uh, you know, in a magazine or whatnot, and then you get you get it in person, and it was great both ways, right? But there's some times where you'll get you'll see fabric, and you're thinking, okay, that's super cute, I love it. But then it comes in, and it, it's over and above what you thought it was going to be. It's like so awesome. Um, okay, so we've got that pattern, and now we're going to have a series of projects included, and. That's one of them I'm assuming. Oh my goodness, they had this pillow on their uh, Instagram. I love that pillow. Look at the, with the little ruffle, I love that. And here it looks like you can do a miniature of Little Dreamer right there. Okay, let's look inside. All right, so. We have Kids Stuff Book Tote, and that's the thing that's on the front cover. Make sure you see that. And the finished size is 11 inches by 12 inches when it's folded. You'll need three fat quarters, some clear vinyl, 11 inch by four inch. Um, you'll need a fat quarter for the binding You'll need a button for the closure. You'll need two buttons for the handle. You'll need a nylon zipper and some Annie's soft and stable. And it's super cute. Okay, here we go. There's two pages for that. <clears throat> okay, see, they calling it Mini Little Dreamer. And there it is. Yay, I guessed it. <laughs> Um, this will finish at 19 inches square. You'll need 13 of these charm squares. You'll need one fat quarter for the binding. Oh, I'm sorry, I read that wrong. You'll need one fat quarter for the background, one fat quarter for the border, one fat quarter for the binding. You'll need a backing piece of 20 inches square, and you'll also need some batting at 20 inches square. Okay. That's super cute, and it's, it's so easy to put together. Okay, and then the ruffle pillow. There's the ruffle pillow. So pretty. And that white with the words on it, that was, that's like one of my favorite prints in the whole collection. Uh, you'll need two fat quarters. You'll need five five-inch charm squares. So five of these. And you'll need a 16-inch square pillow form. Okay, and that looks pretty simple. Then they have a, oh, okay, so this is for the Sweetwater Sew Along if you're participating in that. Uh, this is box number two, where we'll have those little houses. And 
For this, you'll need the cream background, which is what this is. You're gonna cut the cream background fabric into three squares at five and a half inches each. You're gonna to need to um, have some printed fabric scraps, whatever prints you like, some fusible web and some black embroidery floss. Um, okay. So those are the projects for this month. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited for the fabric. I just, I remember whenever they first showed it to us, I was like so excited about it. It's so cute. Um, so let me put some of this stuff back and then I will show you the fat quarters. Just kind of, kind of move it over. And that, and I'll scooch this over. And I will leave that intact. And now, if I can, what is that? Oh, I don't know. Okay, so I'm gonna open this up. Let's do it. <laughs> Let's just do it. And once I have it open, I mean, then that gives me like free reign to start using it. So, you know, sometimes you just gotta pop that baby open. <laughs> All right, let me put that over there, my little trash pile. Okay, put that over there. All right, here we go, guys, you ready? <laughs> this is the first um, cream colored and it's a toss of all the animals in those animal crackers. And then this is a cream color with a tone on tone. If you could see those little, uh, it's like a some circle dots. You'll see what the design is a little bit better when we get to the actual colors. Um, but that's, this is really nice. I like that. And then this one, it's cream, but you can see, uh, you probably won't be able to tell what that is, but it's like letters and numbers, or maybe it's just numbers. No, actually, I think it's just numbers. And they're kind of small, and like I said, um, you'll be able to see it a little bit better once we get to the colored fabric. Okay, and then this is one of my faves. It is a cream color with a um, bunch of words on it, and the words are animals. <laughs> so you'll have things like dog, hippo, turtle, flamingo, otter, turkey, whale, bunny, Sheep, zebra, elephant, giraffe, uh, alligator, a bunny. There is, there's a whole bunch. I'm trying to, rhinoceros, penguin, monkey, chicken, bear, moose, cat, ostrich, lion, seal, otter, um, duck, frog, pig, tiger, um, horse, Y'all, there's a lot. <laughs> and I just, I love the whole thing. Oh my goodness. We're going to keep going because this is a lot of fabric. Um, now, this is the cream with those numbers and the numbers are now in color. Do you hear somebody down there? I don't know who it is. I don't think it's Sammy, but I don't know. And then here's the cream with those um, dot circles. That's what I'm going to call them. And those are in color. And, okay, now we have a cow toss. <laughs> I love it. So it's a cream with a little cow toss on it. <laughs> and, oh, my goodness, I love these. Look at these, guys. Um... So you've got these little squares and each square has just has a little X in it. That's all it is. But it's this wonderful blender. I just, I, I love, sometimes I like to think like, how do people come up with their ideas? Because then you see it come through and it's just like, <laughs> and this is the orange print with the numbers. 
And now we have the orange with monkey toss. <laughs> and I love how they've got the little hearts on them. Am I too close? I think I'm too close. Oh my goodness, so cute. And this is orange with those uh, circles, circle dots in red. And now this is the orange with uh, animal toss. The animal cracker tosses. These are so adorable. <laughs> okay, now this is a cream with uh, monkey toss with the hearts. I think I have some of this in my shop. Uh, just to tell you guys, I don't have like a whole bunch. I really don't. Um, but I'll let you know. I think I also have like a very small amount of this. Um, and I think so far that's all. Oh my goodness, y'all, look at this. Oh, I just love it, how it's not perfect. You know, like the lines in the middle, they're just kind of drawn. They look like they're just put in there by hand. And this red is so rich. I love it. Okay, and then we have um, this red with little hearts in it. And if you don't look too close, you'd almost think that they're like, like little, the mark that little chicken feet make, right? <laughs> but it's hearts. And then we have that red with the numbers on it. And then we have those squares with the X's inside on red background. That almost sounds like jelly bean. I don't know who it is though. This is the red with the little circle dots in white. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm looking at the next one. I keep looking ahead. I need to like stop. This is the red with a cow toss again. <laughs> and here is the fabric with words in black. And then here is the black with uh, the numbers. And now we have black with an alligator toss. I'm a little partial to alligators, I have to say. I kind of like that. And here is a teal blue, sort of a teal. Would I call that teal? I, it doesn't even matter because it's got a cow toss on it. <laughs> Maybe it's more like a light aqua. I'm not sure. Now this is a white with that aqua squares and little X's in the boxes. And here we have that, uh, oh my God, I just love it. This plaid, I'm calling it a plaid. I don't know if you would consider that a plaid. I, I do, and it's just a plaid that I absolutely adore. I love it. I, I need to like find a quilt where I can put every single one of these fabrics in it. <laughs> okay, here's that teal with uh, the little white hearts. And now we've got the teal with white squares and red X's inside. This is the teal with monkey toss. I'm just gonna say teal guys. This is a teal <laughs> with the white dot circles or circle dots. And this is a teal with a animal cracker toss. So you got all the animals. And 
now we have uh, teal with the words. There we go. I just love how they did the letters and they like fill them in and uh, This is teal with an alligator toss. You can't even hardly tell that's teal because the colors are like they're competing for. <laughs> Look how it keeps changing with the light. That's just so funny. It's like the same teal as the others. Um, now this is, um, I think I have this one in the shop. It is a cream with alligator toss. I know I have an alligator toss in the shop. I don't remember exactly which, but I think it's this one. And then we have the that green of the alligator in this plaid. I think it's beautiful. I love that. And this is a cream with that green squares and then there's little black X's inside. And it's funny, I'm saying green, they call it pickle. <laughs> I love that. So this is pickle with hearts, and I think I have this one in the shop. So you got a heart pickle, or pickle hearts. <laughs> and then we have uh, that pickle with a monkey toss. love the monkeys and then we have the pickle with white circle dots I'm having a little bit too much fun with the pickle right this pickle <laughs> with the words <laughs> and last one is pickle with a cow toss So guys, it is a big collection, it is a big collection. I, you know, you, I see them and I'm thinking, oh my goodness, I would love to have the whole collection. But in order to get it all, I mean, you know, to get, how many SKUs is this? It's a lot. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So it's 28. Okay, I can't do math right now. There's a lot of SKUs. <laughs> like uh, upwards of like 40, 40 SKUs in here. And, you know, to buy a, an entire bolt of like 40, that's a lot. <laughs> I wanted them. I thought that they were like so super cute, but I didn't get them. Um, I got a few. So I got a few of them in the shop and uh, you can go and check it out. See if you like any of them. And yeah, so that's my project, Sweetwater. I'm so happy to be able to share the entire collection with you so that you can see all of the lovely fabrics that are included inside. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.